Okay, so now in the next part of this lesson, what we'll do is we'll create that page. Now, how does a thesis user usually create a page that's going to display only posts from a certain category? Well, the way you usually do that is you come down here to Thesis Options, and under Thesis Options, you go over to the Navigation menu, and you s select this Include These Category Pages in the Nav menu, and you would select Upcoming Events, because that's the category. Scroll down and select Save. And now if you go over and refresh, you'll see that there is this upcoming events tab that if you select it, it will display uh, everything that it finds under the category upcoming events, which is the same thing currently as this right here, except that we have thesis configured currently just to show the title. If you select the title, you can see it takes you to the actual post. We'll go back. Obviously, that doesn't create what we wanted it to create. Well, it creates what we expected, which is it gives you a listing of all of the posts that are in that category that have been published. But that doesn't actually give us what we're looking for. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to create a new page. And what we're going to do is actually look at Edit, because I've already created this page, this Unpublished Future Events page. You know how to create a page already, but select edit and you'll see what's here. I don't have any text here. I have its attributes as being a main page, so it's not under any parent. Rather than the default template, which is what is ordinarily selected here, I have the custom template selected, and that's it. Go ahead and say update. And here's our page, unpublished future events. So in order for us to see this unpublished future events page, what we have to do is scroll down here to Thesis Options again. Go over to the nav Navigation menu, and this time select Pages to include in the Nav menu. So if we select Unpublished Future Events, and then select Save. Now if we refresh this page, you can see we have Unpublished Future Events and Unpublished Future Events has absolutely nothing in it because we haven't given it anything to go in there. Okay, so what do we have now? We have a home page that displays every single post that has been actually published. We have an upcoming events page which displays every post that has been published under the category upcoming events and we have a page that displays nothing because we haven't given it anything to display. Now this will display unpublished posts of the category upcoming events by the time we're finished with this.